Summer is a time for movie blockbusters. Every year, millions of people flood to the cinemas for the latest releases. With summer being such a lucrative time of the year for the silver screen, how can the industry best capitalise on audiences and the choices they make? It all starts with data. So Movio knows who's likely to watch a film by building up a deep profile of each and every moviegoer and using that history to try and predict their future. And so what we're about is trying to understand what the moviegoer wants and connecting them with their ideal movie. And if we do that, distribution, studios and uh, cinema chains will benefit. There's plenty of data available from point of sale, loyalty schemes, social media channels and increasingly mobile apps. But the way we generally buy cinema tickets means there's a gap. The challenges are really around the fact that nearly 80% of all admissions are collected offline. So um, Movio has to connect to all of the different offline channels, not just the online tickets that are purchased, uh, to build those full profiles of what moviegoers really want to see. But once you've got all that data, it allows potential customers to be segmented by the films they want to see and the likelihood they're going to see it. That can help the movie world build targeted marketing campaigns. This data can inform marketing decision makers by allowing them to focus more on the creative messaging and what they want to say to moviegoers rather than who the audience is they need to target. This information can be used in many different ways, whether that's greenlighting a film up front to work out whether there's an audience, setting a media plan at a studio, right through to programming the film so that it's got the right number of screens for the audience that's going to be most interested in it. We randomly remove a control group out of every single campaign and measure how they perform at the box office versus those that were in the target audience, thus being able to measure return on every single campaign. The weekend of the 20th of July kicks off the summer season. The long-awaited sequel of Mamma Mia, Here We Go Again, will be on first weekend release along with two other sequels, The Equalizer 2 and Unfriended The Dark Web. Meanwhile, yet another sequel, Hotel Transylvania 3, is on its second week, along with modern-day towering Inferno film Skyscraper. Ant-Man and the Wasp is on week three. So what does the data suggest about how these films are going to perform? The weekend of July 20th is a particularly interesting weekend in the film business. Um, what makes it so unique is it is a release of a bunch of new films that are coming out, but there is something for every audience. Uh, in particular, the big release that we're very excited about is Mamma Mia, uh, which in the last one was hugely successful, although what was unique about it is it grew over time to being something quite phenomenal. We expect this to do the same. It's predicted Mamma Mia's audience will be mainly older, with 60% of 50-plus females and just under half of 50-plus males going to see the film on the opening weekend. It suggests better ROI will be driven focusing on this group with relevant content and offers. For example, buy two tickets, get popcorn free, given the movie is likely to be seen by couples. Demographics are still important for cinemas allocating screens later in a film's life. For example, Ant-Man and the Wasp, now in its third weekend cycle. Millennial males may be turned off by Mamma Mia, but still wanting to see this Marvel Disney film, or perhaps Skyscraper. But 40% of Gen X males are likely to go and see Ant-Man this weekend as the audience for the film evolves. Older movie fans often see films later in their run. So marketers could see a better return spreading their campaign before and after the film film is released rather than just before. Meanwhile, Hotel Transylvania 3 is likely to be the winner for Generation X females taking their family to the movies. But there can be problems when one film dominates at the box office. The recent Avengers movie was a triumph for Disney, but the cinema as a whole suffered as alienated moviegoers abandoned a trip to the flicks. Data insights going forward should help the whole industry win. This will make an enormous difference to the success of the cinema industry as a whole. Uh, if you have got a scenario where every moviegoer can arrive at the cinema and there's something for them to see every weekend, it will change the cadence and the performance of every film that's in market. So I think the dynamics of setting the films up so that they're optimised for the, the audience is key to success in the theatrical business. Hello, I'm James Wright. Thanks for watching Marketing Media Money. To check out more online videos, just click on the boxes and don't forget to subscribe to the CNBC Life channel at the bottom of the screen.